Hey there YouTube, Travis here. No mopeds in this video today, but I am packing up my Moped Army Secret Santa. And I suppose it's not technically true there are no mopeds in this video. I have my living room Clinton Sachs moped watching over. But uh, today we are boxing up the Moped Army gift exchange uh, presents that I've purchased. I had some fun with this. I thought I'd walk you guys through what I bought. Uh, not saying who I got, no spoilers here yet, but for a short explanation, uh, Moped Army official members in the members forum uh, have a gift exchange and this year uh, I participated. So the limit was around $20 and do a quick walkthrough of some of the things I bought. So over Thanksgiving I stopped by Jake Spangle's house in Oakland and crashed with him for a few days and he took me to the Daiso Japanese store and man okay I'll also preface this by saying I don't know anything about uh, my recipient of my secret Santa it's not someone I've met in person before um, I only know their name I don't know how old they are what size they are so I had a lot of fun with this because this is either gonna go awesome or it's not gonna click at all so I got this awesome and everything in the Daiso store uh, is a dollar fifty unless otherwise specified. So it's a great place to shop. Got this sweet stick-on toilet seat cover, which I thought was kind of gross, but uh, I couldn't not get it. So these ones were marked up a little more expensive, three bucks. We got these very cute panda slippers. Uh, very useful. I got these uh, chair leg socks. Um, these are definitely going to be very useful for whoever receives my my Mopin Army gift exchange. This is awesome. I almost wanted to keep this for myself. This is a syringe mechanical pencil. Um, I really like this. this. This is pretty cool. Here's something that they might actually be able to utilize. I was really stoked when I saw these uh, in the store, but different uh, metric wrenches all the way down to the smaller ones. I can think of... Uh, removing jets from some carburetors. Uh, these might actually end up uh, being pretty useful. Some strange candy. There was one where it was dried squid and it didn't really say it on the package and I was really tempted to buy that and include it, but it's getting close to the top of my budget and didn't want to do that per se. This is the cutest kitchen timer. This is so cute. This is This is pretty cool. This is something nice to keep around on top of the stove so you don't have to pull out, pull out your phone once again unnecessarily. And also for the kitchen, got this monkey style hot pan holder. Also got these, this glass jar here with some good friend, you make me so happy, very, very positive kitty images on it. And look at that, even adopting this persona all over the place now. Great. And also, I'm a member of the Puddle Cutters out of Portland, Oregon now, so we're including some patches uh, and then some stickers of various sizes here too. Also some vintage rally shirts. Uh, this was the Camp Cutterwana rally, which was the first Cutters rally I went to, summer of 2015. And then I also have this hot-blooded shirt uh, from 2011, uh, which is before I was born. So that's great, too. Okay, there, YouTube. Well, there she is, all boxed up. I'll go ahead and give you guys an update when I get mine in the mail. But until then, until next time.